And here's the first set of examples. And here we're supposed to find or supposed to convert the exponential form to logarithmic form. So what they're giving us is they're giving us something in this form and they want us to go back and express it in terms of the exponential form. And before we get started, take a look at this. So we have this here is the x of the equation. The base is right here, so this is considered the base. And we use the letter b for that. And then here would be the exponent, so this would be the value for y. So then we want to plug it into this equation right there. So we take y is equal to the log base b of x. And so in this case, y was equal to 3. So 3 is equal to the log of base, and the base was 5. And x was 125. And there you go. So that's the conversion from the exponential form to the logarithmic form. And so we're going to do that for each one of those. So remember, this is the base. This is the value for y. And this is the, <coughs> the value for x. So in this case, we're going to get y, which is minus 3, is equal to the log of the base 10 of this number 0 0.001. And over here again, we have y, which is minus 2, equals the log of the base, and the base in this case is 4, and we take that of 1 16th, and finally, here we have 1 3rd, we take the exponent, that becomes the y, is equal to the log of the base 8, Oop. I want to write the base, it should be written slightly below the log, like that, base 8, uh, of the number 2. And that's how we convert from exponential form to logarithmic form. So in this case, we're going from the exponential form back to the logarithmic form. All right, 